CCTV had just broadcasted a short clip of live drill using the latest anti-stealth radar, which is China PLA flagship radar system, that is the YLC-8E anti-stealth radar. This radar covers UHF, L, S and C bands and has the basic characteristics of fourth generation intelligence radar, utilizing fully digital and most advanced technologies. In the video, it was shown in a live drill to use such radar to discover and track stealth target drones and guide to intercept them. It was said that advanced electronic warfare equipment was also used. It is not clear what type of stealth target drones were used from this live drill clip. China has been developing target stealth drones trying to mimic F-22 and F-35 planes, such as the LJ-1 or LJI stealth drone. The YLC-8E anti-stealth radar was first shown to the public in last year's China Air Show. There was a brief interview with the chief engineer of the development of this radar. Now behind me is a large anti-stealth radar. Its current state is a transportation state, loaded by truck chassis. But once the equipment is turned on, the power of this radar will show with powerful functions enabling it to detect, track and lock the stealth fighters in the air. It is now fully unfolded. Its height is about 3 to 4 stories high and its area is about 100 square meters. It only takes several minutes from the transportation state to the fully deployed actual combat state. This speed amazes me. This radar is called YLC-8E, a new type of highly maneuverable anti-stealth radar. It was developed by the 14th Research Institute of China Electric Technology. From the appearance, it has a high degree of resolution. On this radar front, there are countless T-shaped devices. These are the transceiver antennas on each unit. In fact, the entire front is made up of countless small radars. The radar beam emitted by this radar will be very long. For some stealth aircraft, it does have very effective detection capabilities. As a large-scale backbone radar of the radar network, YLC-8E is responsible for medium to high altitude and medium to long-range air warring and guidance tasks to search, track, lock, and guide. What battle scenarios can such an anti-stealth radar be suitable for? This radar is mainly capable of detecting aerodynamic form-driven flying targets such as stealth aircraft and drones. This is a radar combined with one-dimensional rotational scanning and two-dimensional phase scanning, that covers 360 degrees. Is such a huge radar power hungry? Does it work long hours? This is a fourth-generation intelligence radar, so it needs to work continuously for a long time. Therefore, the energy consumption is huge. However, in the design process, we adopted some efficient design methods, including the use of third-generation semiconductor devices, so energy consumption was greatly reduced. This kind of giant radar is indeed a demon mirror on the battlefield. Because of this radar, the fourth-generation advanced aircraft no longer dare fly unscrupulously. It is not clear what type of stealth target drones were used from this live drill clip. China has been developing target stealth drones trying to mimic F-22 and F-35 planes, such as the LJ-1 or LJI stealth drone. The LJ-1 target stealth drone was first shown to the public in last year's China Air Show. Take a look at the drone next to me. Through its material and shape, we can see that it has a certain stealth capability. So, what does this advanced drone do? It is an unmanned aerial vehicle for the Blue Side Army mission. In the war game, the Blue Side Army is the enemy army. In other words, this is a stealth target drone for the Red Side Army. 
We often use the blue forces in military training as enemy forces in battle. A powerful enemy force is like a sharpener. The drone we saw is a high-tech sharpener. Its function is to more realistically simulate the enemy on the air battlefield. This drone simulates the third and fourth generation main combat aircraft on the blue side. It has several major characteristics. The first is the long voyage, large maneuvering, stealth, and recoverable. Red side troops can attack us with real weapons. As the Blue Army, we can achieve a combat-oriented confrontation whether as a single plane, a dual plane, or as a side-to-side -side formation. If there is a red missile attacking us, we can use chaff jamming bombs, infrared jamming bombs, and other such jamming strategies. Thus, the evasion of weapon attacks can be identified. At the same time, this aircraft has great maneuverability, so it can also use large maneuvers to achieve evasion in the event of an attack. When the drone is launched, it can fully simulate a full imaginary enemy plane, from its external flight status to invisible electronic signal characteristics and tactical tactics. It even knows how to evade missiles, release interference, or simulate combat systems in coordination with other fighters. The application of such unmanned aerial vehicles has opened up a whole new field in the direction of improving the combat capability of manned aircraft. Stealth target drone for the red side army. We often use the blue forces in confrontation, whether as a single plane, a dual